Greetings y'all, it's Matt from the Grain Arcade, back playing some more Farming Simulator 17. We're back at uh, Giant's Island, and today we are about liquidation. We're going to get rid of some stuff. So let's get to it. We're going to get rid of, let's see, I think we bought a big planter, didn't we? Or did we? No? Yes, we did, there it is. It's on this tractor. So we've got a big planter. We don't really need a cultivator right now. We're not going to get right into corn. Uh, so we're going to get rid of these. I'm going to get rid of the cultivator. And this planter. I'm going to keep the little tractor for now. I think it's uh, fairly brand new. Let's see, why can't I hook up to that? There we go. So I'm going to haul these up to the shop and uh, sell them. I think this is a straight road to the shop, isn't it? Yeah, I can go straight to the shop this way. Or pretty much straight. So yeah, we're uh, starting out here on Giants Island. Uh, need to get back over to the harvesters over here. They're over here at Field 11 anyway, so... Uh, we need to work on plowing that, actually. And I think we already own that plow, so... Uh, we can get on that right away. I will say the only thing I don't like about this tractor is it doesn't have any beacons. I'm very, very disappointed that there's no beacons on it. I mean, it's a, it's a really nice sized tractor. It's not really the smallest tractor. It just doesn't have any beacons, man. What? Well, come on. We gotta have beacons. I mean, at least, you know, enable hazards. If it had hazards, I wouldn't be as, you know, upset about it. But, uh, it doesn't even, we don't even have hazards, so. Where are the beacons? Hey, where's the beef? Alright, let's turn and go. We'll just go ahead and cross the road. And make a right here, I guess. Got our uh, big tractor there on the planter. He's ready to plant, but I think we're going to plow it first because it, it doesn't... Uh, you can't hire workers on it real like you should. So we're going to fix that. No, I don't want to fill it up. Cover cover came off automatically. All right, let's see now. Which one? I'm going to drop the back one first. And then I'll just turn around and drop the front one. All right. Oh, that must be the, uh, when you purchase extra, that must be where it goes. It goes back there, because there's a pallet back there, too. So if we purchase it, and it, there's not enough room up here in the front, I guess it goes back there. Alright, and I think we're going to sell that small tipper, too, so let me go grab it. Now, I think we got a couple more fields to harvest. Number 2 and 17. We'll do 2 first. And then we'll go down and hit 17. Well, these are nice size fields up here. And these we can plow together. I'm looking forward to this. Once we... Uh, Either decide to buy them at some point or something. We can plow all this up and make it all one big field right here. And if there's no rocks on that other end, you know, minus the windmill down there, we can plow them together. But there's no rocks or anything up here that I see right away. I don't know. We may leave this road. This is a nice uh, little access road to get to the shop fast. But it's one of the few that we can plow together, so... I don't know. We'll wait and see. Alright, tipper. I guess we'll keep the sprayer. And we'll keep that little silage shovel thing. I haven't really worked with those yet. Is there anything else around here that we can get rid of? We actually got some seed pellets in there that we can use. 
Let me check. Uh, let me just check the garage here just to see what all we have. All right, I haven't. We got those up there. We haven't sold those yet. Uh, no, that looks like it. So just this last tipper. We're gonna keep all of our tractors and stuff. So. Got all these windmills out here and they're not ours. We're not making any profit off of them. It's a little disappointing, but uh, I guess we could uh, put our own out here and uh, give them some competition, maybe. A lot of nice large fields here. I like the nice large fields. See, look at them. I mean, there's just so many from left to right. And a lot of them we can plow together and just make huge fields. Maximize the uh, the yield off of them. And see even these trees here. See these trees? We can cut those down and plow that all under and make it all field. We can plow this hill up here, I guess, if we wanted, really wanted to, and plant all that. And have some nice crop crop yields off of that. Drive a little in-cab here. I like the digital uh, speedometer. It's different. Alright, I think I can back this in there maybe in between those. Or just drop it right on the edge here. I'll just drop it right on the edge. Alright. We will sell these. And that's it, that's it, that's all we had in there, alright. Um, there's the uh, church on the hill over there. So let's go over and meet our uh, counterparts over here. Oh, didn't shut the engine off. So we're done harvesting field, uh, what is it, 11 here? Yeah. Um... Looks like canola was on it, so uh, probably low yields off of it right away. Going to plow this up uh, before we plant it again, I think. Just so we can utilize the hired workers on it better. Let's take our harvesters down to, um, or up to, field two. And we'll get them started up there. Hopefully that one goes a little bit better than this one. We're going to fold up the harvester just for travel. Am I going the right way at least? Yeah. Alright. I'm hoping I don't have to get header carts. I'm hoping I can just, you know, it's since it's such a small island that the neighbors or the locals will be okay with me just driving through town with the header on. I can drive through some of this other, like the grass and stuff over here. Um, I wonder if it would let me plow this up. It might say you don't own this field, so then we just could mow it, maybe. Alright, let me get across the road before that truck cuts down here. I'm going the right way, yes? Yes, okay. Now I wonder if I would be better off going off the edge here, or is there fencing in the way? Like going through the backyards over there? Maybe. No, 
I see a fence. Well, looks like it runs along the border of it, maybe. I think it's a work. Totally works. I just drive through the backyards here. Instead of driving on the main road. There's too much traffic on the main road. Can I fit through here though? Ooh. Just barely. I made it though. Ooh, big horn on this little combine. And see, if they hadn't put these rocks here, we could have plowed this up. But we can't to plow it up, so... Because we can't move the rocks. They are stationary. Guess we could just plow that up a little bit in there if we want, absolutely wanted to, but that's not enough to really, uh, to really matter. Alright, we'll harvest this. I gotta unfold my harvester first. I don't think the hired worker will work this way like that, but I think it will work this way like this. Yeah, that works pretty good like that. We'll just run it like that and let him finish out this field and uh, get the uh, tippers up there. See, I can't. Can I go up in my... Yeah, I can go up. It goes 32. Uh, we'll have to use the back tipper, though. I guess I could swing by the... Where's the homestead? Eh. I don't think I'll get a full tipper off of that up there. I'll just go ahead and drive up there. Just put it in the back tipper. Because field 17 is wheat and that's not what we just harvested so we got three different crops we got uh, canola that we just harvested in 11 barley in 2 and wheat in 17 so did I get a little bit of canola in that back one no it looks empty to me we'll find out in just a minute where's the homestead Well, the homestead's just right over here. Let me just go ahead and go dump it. Just in case we need more than one tipper. Alright, what is the smallest field? Field 21 looks like the smallest one to me on here. So we're going to go check the price of that. Uh, whoops, I missed my turn. Either field 21 or... Seven. No, it still looks like 21 might be. What is that over there between field 15 and 16? Is that forest? Yeah, that's that's woods over there, so we can't really do anything with that. Um, yeah, 21. Let's see how much it is. Is it on the way? No, it's kind of down there, isn't it? Whoa, 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 whip it. Make sure that don't have anything in it. It says zero, but just double checking just to be sure. Come on, tractor, pull the hill. Pull it, pull it, pull it. Go. Hey, the traffic actually uses their signals here. I just noticed that. I 
All right, I don't think I'm going to bring the other harvester up here. I think we can handle it with this little guy because this is such, I mean, it's such a far distance up here. So let me get down here, and I'm sure he'll need an empty very soon. And he missed this little bit right here because I cut this first little bit here. I know that's why, so... All right, he's good to go. I'm going to move the big combine actually over to 17. And he's actually got canola left in him. Great. So I can't do that right away. I'll just drive him over to the homestead. I think it's on the way to 17, yeah. I'll leave him there, and then uh, I'll offload him once I get done with this barley up here at the north. Guess I could drive down to 21 real quick and see how that how much that field is. 21 and um, then it looks like maybe 6 and 7. Well, they're right here on the way. Let me just stop here and see how much they are. See if they're any cheaper than 21. And that's actually in soybeans, isn't it? Alright, let's see how much these are. Hop out and leave my engine running here. Uh, let's see, this is 6. It's 30,000, that's not bad. This is 7, I think, yeah. It's 30,800, not bad. Eight, uh, same price, thirty thousand eight hundred. So these, these are all three thirty thousand. So not bad for these. They're nice and square, and if you buy more than one, you can plow them together. Just out of curiosity, let's go see how much uh, twenty one is. I think I just took the long way, but oh well. You know what? Let me go check on my other harvester. He's almost full. Let me offload him first. I think I blocked him. Let's see here. It's because it's that large head. You have to, I mean, there's very little room for, uh, to play around with here to get him to empty into you while you're doing this. Very little. I'm just going to drive over that crop there. I don't, I don't think it, uh, will hurt anything just right here on the end. All right, so he's empty now. I'm going to let him go on. Maybe he'll pick up and go back. Will he? Yeah, he's going to go get it. All right, not bad. So hopefully he'll finish that out right there. And let me finish driving him down here. I want to run down here and see how much 21 is real quick. Come on, let's go. If I'd hit the right button, it might go. So 30,800 on those other ones.
21, 21, right. There's so many here close together. I think it's this one right here. It looks like it's already been harvested. Let's see how much it is. 36,602, so it's more. So I think we'll wait on these. This is field 21, right? Yeah. Uh, it is maybe not the smallest field, but uh, I think we'll get 6, 7, and 8 first uh, because they're cheaper. And we can plow, actually plow them together. So next episode, we'll come back and uh, we'll start harvesting this large field. Where is it? Somewhere here. Back uh, to our left. Right up there. You can see it. It's ready to go. We own that one, 17. We'll come back and harvest, uh, get the harvest started on that with the combines. And uh, we'll wrap up this harvest and uh, buy some fields and go from there. So until next time, guys, remember you reap what you sow. It's Matt from the Grain Arcade. See you guys next time.